entire holy book contains the word blood more times than the words love, forgiveness, and beauty combined, your religion might be bullshit. If your religion claims that an omnipotent spirit being from another dimension raped a young human girl already engaged to be married in order to give birth to himself so he could later torture himself to death as a sacrifice to himself to appease himself for something he started in the first place, your religion might be bullshit. If your religion participates in cannibalism but conveniently renames it transubstantiation, your religion might be bullshit. If your God is more concerned about a man having sex with a woman during her period than condemning pedophilia and rape, your religion might be bullshit. If your religious leaders wear magical underwear day and night to protect them from demons, your religion might be bullshit. If your religion promises unending torture in the afterlife for all those who don't believe what you believe, your religion might be bullshit. If your religion was created by a science fiction writer in 1953, your religion might be bullshit. If your religion touts an omnipotent God who doesn't want to have to torture anyone for all eternity, yet he ain't willing to simply show himself in order to help the more skeptical among us avoid the torture device that he himself created, your religion might be bullshit. If your religion has convinced you that an all-seeing spirit being from another dimension is watching you 24-7 even while you're throttling your poultry, your religion might be bullshit. If your religion entails the worship of an all-powerful deity but needs a constant influx of money in order to do his work, your religion might be bullshit. If your religion commands the murder of a woman just because she likes to start her morning off with a little Egg McMuff, well, your religion might be bullshit. If your religion demands the murder of a man we'll call John just because he likes to call up his buddy Bob and plow the backfield together, so to speak, and just because he likes to call up his other buddy Steve and take an occasional road trip up the old Hershey Highway, your religion might be bullshit. If your religion's primary sources of information are anonymous and forged writings written in ancient languages no one's even used for thousands of years, your religion, it might be some bullshit. If your religion views women as inferior to men, your religion might be bullshit. If your holy book advises husbands on how to beat their wives, your religion might be bullshit. If your religion was created by a single person, your religion might be bullshit. If your religion was created by a single person who was also a pedophile, your religion might be bullshit. If your religion cares more about people drawing cartoons than about women's rights, your religion might be bullshit. If your religion advocates owning other humans and actually depicts God giving advice on how to sell someone into slavery, your religion might be bullshit. If your religion deliberately murdered millions of people, just because them people didn't believe the same religion you do, well, your religion might be bullshit. If your holy book is thousands of pages long, but ain't got a single joke, your religion might be bullshit. If the cornerstone of your religion is the unjust, bloody torture and death of an innocent man, your religion might be bullshit. If your God is so inept at communication that he has to appoint people to explain to other people 
just what he wants from them. Your religion might be bullshit. If your religion is split into tens of thousands of splinter cults, all believing different doctrines, yet all claiming to be the one true religion, your religion might be bullshit. If you currently live on a planet where your religion is just one of thousands of others, your religion might be bullshit. If there was ever a time in history when your religion didn't exist, your religion might be bullshit. If a god you worship is prone to petty human emotions such as hate, jealousy, and vengeance, and anger, and all that, your religion might be bullshit. If your religion contains ancient stories depicting the omnipotent god of the universe drowning helpless babies, or burning little babies to death, or ordering his chosen people to hack newborn babies to pieces in order to accomplish his goals, well, there ain't no might about it. Your religion is definitely bullshit.